Hey guys, uh, it's Mike again. Today I'm going to show you how to install the Canon US Utility without uh, the original CD because everyone loses theirs or your computer just doesn't have a ROM like mine did it. Uh, Canon's being stupid, like foolish in my opinion. It doesn't even allow you to download that online like most drivers. So I'm just going to go to Google, um, good old Google, and uh, type in Canon dri drivers. Yeah, should be good. And then click on that first result. Um, yeah, consumer crap, whatever. Um, so type in your camera name. I think I mean it's all the same software, but you know just to be safe, just get the right one for your camera. Oh, you probably don't have to say Canon. They think they know it's a Canon. It's their website. So I have the T3R, and that's the kit I have. And go. And then it's gonna bring you here. You go to drivers and softwares and software EOS utility and if you notice it's only the updater you know um, doesn't give you the actual thing just the updater but that's okay I'm gonna go ahead and download this thing yes yes save it um, one minute left yeah I don't wanna wait I already downloaded it I got mine right here on my desktop. Um, there's a file already unpackaged it. I'm going to open it up and this is what it brings up. So if you go ahead and launch that, um, it's going to bring up this. All right. So first things first actually, you want to type in system preferences, open that up and you want to make sure that under security and privacy you want to make sure that under security and privacy, allow apps downloaded from anywhere. All right, you gotta have that, or you will run into problems later. So apps from anywhere. All right, I already had that set. So then, uh, you're not gonna launch it from here. I'm gonna drag this to my desktop, and I can go ahead and close this out. All right, after closing that out, we got the. Here's the file the installer. Instead of opening it, I'm gonna right click it, click Show Package Contents, and uh. I've already been there. So there's contents. Then you want to, you're uh, gonna want to go under resources, and then look for uh, that note info, info .datx. and simply eh, delete that. Move it to trash, whatever. Get rid of it. And go ahead and close that out. Then remember we allowed all programs to be installed. So I'm go ahead and launch this now. Yes, open. And oh look, it's extracting. Yay, it's working. And yeah, from the U.S. of A. But no, I'm from Africa. Actually, I live in the U.S. of A. Go ahead and uh, go ahead and install this bad boy. It's as easy as that. Um, yeah, sure. And um, U.S. Utility is a super useful thing. Honestly, I use it all the time. You'll find the use for it. Um, did this video because. The last one with the windows, probably my most popular video, just because it's so frustrating. Like, why wouldn't they release the install? But it doesn't matter. It's actually a really simple way to get around that. And uh, the Windows one, actually, it's even easier than the Windows one. I'm just going to let this install out. See if that thing opens up. You guys can actually go now. You can close out this video and install it and have fun with your EOS utility. But I do appreciate you guys sticking around. You guys are the real MVPs. Oh, you guys see my screen recorder? Alright, um. EOS utility. <laughs> Just woke up, guys. And there it is. It's working. And go ahead and hook up your camera. You can, you know what? I'm actually gonna pause this. Go grab my camera and test it out. All right, I grabbed my camera, hooked it up. Um, it's in some video mode. See now, now I can uh, do this: camera settings slash remote shooting, and it brings this up. And then go ahead and click live view shoot. This is 
This is what I'm seeing. You know, it's pretty delayed for some reason. Uh, I don't know. I'm running a Hackintosh dual boot. Might have something to do with it, but there's there's my beats. You know, there's the audio recorder, the wallet, the webcam, the the router and crap. So anyway, go ahead and shut that off. Good luck to you all. Have fun. And uh, thanks for watching. This video was long overdue.